Welcome back, guys. Favorite trainer, Kathy from. One second. That's better. Kathy Fitness, back with another video. It's going to be an update. I'm um, five weeks out from Provincials. I'm not sure if you can see all these boxes on the side, but we got some new Kathy Fitness merch, which I'm super excited about. The Find Your Strength sweaters, which are very popular. These have been going, going away faster. If you're in the air, shoot me a message, I'll see what I can get you. The link in the description, I'll also post the website where you can buy online to see what we got. So lots of cool styles. So we're heading out to the gym. Last week for my deadlifts, we did a 630, 630-pound single pause mid shin. So today we're still around the RP of eight, so. Let's see what I'm going to hit, and then stay tuned for the end of the video because a lot of people have been asking me what are these RPEs I'm talking about with the rate of perceived exertion, exertion, and how does it look like I keep going up week by week while keeping my work rate pretty, pretty slimmer. So I'm going to talk a little bit, about, a little bit about that at the end of the video. So stay tuned till the end. Let's get to the gym because we got some work to do. So plan for today is hit a 650 dead on shin which I'm pretty sure is actually a pause rep PR. So we'll see how it goes. I'm a little bit tired today, but we got big goals for the future, so I want to make this about an RP of eight. Let's get back to my workout. Enough talking. for pause rep mid chin and I'm super happy with how that went five weeks out from provincials I couldn't be happier I honestly don't think it could have moved better so a lot of people ask me how come it looks like your lifts are so easy in the gym and what are the RPs you're always talking about so the RP system basically stands for rate of perceived exertion so zero would be the absolute easiest thing you can do and ten will be like you have nothing more in the tank so when I'm gearing up for competition, what I'll generally do is I'll, when I'm a few months out, I will do higher volume, a lower intensity. Then as I get closer to competition, I decrease the volume, increase the intensity so that my RPUs are getting higher. So when you see my singles, I'm never actually doing a 10 before a competition. That's how it always looks like more in the tank. So I hope that clears, clears things up. If there's any videos you want me to cover, any, anything you want to see, let me know in the comments below. I have more videos with Dr. E coming up, and get Catholic, more Catholic fitness swag is on my website. We will catch you next time.